flames attack the Sweetwater Casino. The blaze erupted early this morning, and while there's no official cause yet, authorities think the culprit could have been a bolt of lightning. The restaurant and banquet hall has been a landmark in Sweetwater, New Jersey, Atlantic County, literally on the banks of the Mullica River. And live there tonight, Action News reporter Kathy Gandolfo. Kathy? Well, Jim, that's right. It was a piece of history that went up in smoke today. The Sweetwater Casino has been a popular restaurant in these parts for more than 80 years. This is very historical for us, and it's a meeting place for people here. We'd love to come to the Sweetwater Casino. I'm just devastated that this has happened. That was the feeling today as local residents watched firefighters hose down hot spots at what was the Sweetwater Casino. At 4.15 this morning, flames engulfed the building. Fifteen fire companies did battle in this remote Pinelands location. The Mullica River served as a reservoir to help douse the blaze. We did a uh, limited interior attack, but it was just uh, too much fire, too much uh, heat and smoke backed out and just essentially surround and drown. We went into a defensive fire mode. That meant saving nearby homes, a marina, and preventing a brush fire. The Sweetwater Casino wasn't a casino at all, but in its early days during Prohibition, it was a speakeasy and a place to drink and gamble. Until now, it was a popular restaurant, bar, and banquet hall on the picturesque Mullica River. Do you think you'll be built? It's definitely the plan, yeah. It's the toughest part is how do you rebuild the history, you know. That initial section of the building there was the original Thurston home built in 1927. Heartbreaking. There's so much memories and stuff. The Sweetwater Casino was booked for several events, including a wedding scheduled for this Saturday. Management is working to try and find an another location for that bridal party. In the meantime, officials continue to look for the exact cause. But, Jim, as you mentioned earlier, they are looking at a lightning strike as a real possibility. We're live in Sweetwater, New Jersey. I'm Kathy Gandolfo, Channel 6 Action News. Thank you, Kathy. The Commonwealth of Pennsylvania has...
night, an early morning fire has destroyed a popular restaurant in Mellica Township, the Sweetwater Casino. Phaedra Laird was on the scene today and describes what it was like to see the damage firsthand. Well, Michelle, even though the first of the 15 fire companies responded to the initial call within eight minutes, it still wasn't enough to save this local landmark. I was just engulfed. I mean, flames everywhere. This was the scene when firefighters arrived at the Sweetwater Casino just before 4.30 this morning. Hours later, when the smoke cleared, everyone could see just how much damage had been done. It's very sad. We had a lot of good times here. Actually, each of our girls were... When they were christened, they all had their parties here. We All our family events are, be, have been held here. This was your entire restaurant. Your banquet room was over there. Built in 1927, the popular restaurant, bar, and marina has hosted numerous events over the years. But it's the upcoming happenings that have the owners concerned. Our biggest problem is we had a very large wedding here this Saturday, the 5th. And um, our banquet manager is actually... Um, already has contacted a few of the local banquet facilities and uh, they're hopefully going to help us out to accommodate the, uh, the couple. That's a big concern. Owners say if there is a silver lining to all of this, it's that no one was injured. With no hydrants in the area, firefighters were able to save all the boats and nearby homes by spraying them down with water pumped out of the Mullica River. While it's still unknown what sparked the blaze, officials say severe storms last night could be to blame. Uh, I live a few miles away and I heard, the, I heard the, the, uh, the lightning strike. I guess it's hard for me to understand how a lightning bolt can do so much damage so quickly. Owners say there's no doubt they will rebuild. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you don't have a choice. You, you have to. You know, uh, the tough part's going to be making it what it was. A lot of good time for a lot of people here. A lot of memories. Fire officials say they'll remain here on the scene through the rest of the day and into the evening, just keeping an eye on things and extinguishing any hot spots, also to continue their investigation to try and figure out what sparked this massive blaze. In Mullica Township, I'm Phaedra Laird, News Channel 40, NBC. Well, tonight, authorities are searching for the cause of this fire that destroyed the Sweetwater Casino restaurant. Countless people knew this landmark on 7th Avenue in Sweetwater, stopping there on their way to or from the shore. As New Jersey reporter Sidney Long tells us, owners dealing with the loss are now helping find new venues for their own customers. The first of 15 fire companies which responded to the Sweetwater Casino arrived within eight minutes of when the fire broke out. Investigators are still trying to determine a definitive cause. They say it burned from the inside out. The smoke could be seen for miles as Chopper 3 captured the Sweetwater Casino burning from the sky. It looked like a meteor shower of ash. Daniel Knudsen, who lives next door and got married at the 1927 built landmark restaurant, took these fiery photos on the ground. Red dots coming out of the sky and they were hitting my shed. A couple trees back there, you can almost see them that they're charred. And when they went up, it was like a Roman candle. With the marina and nearby homes in jeopardy, dozens of firefighters spent five hours tackling the fire. Because there are no hydrants, they used tanker trucks and dip into the Mullica River. Thankfully, it wasn't low tide, and thankfully, no one was inside. Twelve hours before, there was probably 200 people here. We were told that there was um, a, a major bolt of lightning that came down along the river. It didn't hit me until I actually got here, you know, and it just... It's devastating. Stan Sacco ran the Sweetwater Casino on and off for 26 years. We used to have a boutique shop and a lounge up top here. 
and we decorated the whole place all the time for the holidays and everything. And it's all gone. Leaving current owners to find alternative arrangements for a wedding that was to take place here this Saturday. A lot of phone calls to make to try to get that, those events going. The restaurant's owners and patrons alike are devastated by this heartbreaking loss. They say even though it may never be the same, they do plan to rebuild the Sweetwater Casino. From Sweetwater, Sydney Long, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.
what is his name? The, um, real nice guy.
Bangkok, because they never can. 